Hello everybody, welcome back. I am <coughs> the Jody Geek and this is day 17 of the Christmas challenge. Um, <coughs> you'll notice I'm wearing all my hockey stuff. Um, this one's probably going to be another bit of a quick one um, because at the time of recording um, I'm pretty much trying to get this done and then straight out the house because uh, Dexter Legion are playing the first game of the season tonight against the Disco Ninjas down in Belmont so I'm doing this for you guys it'll not be up to later so by the time it does go up we'll have finished the game we might have won we might have lost we don't know but I'll tell you about it tomorrow whatever the result was um, so yeah I'm ready to go um, just going to dive straight in last night was the life of Brian um, Monty Python so naturally as like everything they do absolutely hilarious and a really really awesome film um, obviously of course it is based around Brian who people kind of mistake as being Jesus um, he is not the Messiah he's a very naughty boy as I'm sure most people know um, this film is full of just like funny little catchphrases and one liners and stuff um, and other set pieces and stuff as well uh, it's really just more standard Python, it's just super, super funny. Um, watching it really made us just want to go back and watch a ton of their other stuff as well, like The Holy Grail, The Meaning of Life, um, some of the Flying Circus. Um, it even made us just want to rewatch like all the Michael Palin documentaries because they're awesome. Um, so, yeah, if you did watch it, you probably feel the same as me and just want to watch a load of other things as well. <clears throat> I did want to try and find some clips to put on here, but um, obviously with copyrights and stuff, I didn't know uh, if they'd be able to go up, and I don't want to be faffing on till super late and end up missing tonight's deadline to get it on. So um, I'm just going to say all of it was my favourite. Um, you can't watch Life of Brian without singing along at the end as well. Um, it's a pretty iconic song. Um, <clears throat> and even if you didn't sing, you know, I'm going... It's just what happens. It's infectious. Is that a word? Yes, it is a word. Infectious. Yes. Infection-y. In a good way. So, yeah. Um, I will be watching more Monty Python stuff, like I've said, because of that film. Um, it's not, like, a massively festive film, but just because of what it's supposed to be and when it is and stuff, it's kind of... It is for the Christmas season, I would say. So, um, festiveness, I'd still probably give it, like, a seven. We'll just go with that. But... Awesomely funniness. 11. Crank it up. Woo woo. Um, yeah. So tonight, what I will be watching when I get back from hockey, um, so it'll be another late one, um, it's In Bruges, which is the Colin Farrell film where the two hitmen and they, they've got to go and hide out in Bruges, basically. Um, and it's just about that. Uh, it's another really cool film. I have seen it before. Um, and since I have been to Bruges as well, it'll probably be a a nice little watch for us um, so if you haven't seen it watch it tonight and then share your thoughts on it with us um, you can use the comment boxes below on this video um, <clears throat> you can send a, a video clip to james.dixon10 at gmail.com if you want it features on here like my dad's the previous time not the previous time was it the previous time? some of that time that I did it I'm sure it was it's only Tuesday yeah um, you can tweet us, I'm at Dixon10, uh, use the Christmas challenge hashtag, um, or you can go to my blog, um, which is the thejodygeek.wordpress.com for more content like this and other blogs that I do. <clears throat> so until then, um, wishes luck for the past, because I'll have already played, so back to the future? I don't know. Um, hopefully I'll be super happy in my next vlog about the results that we've got. Um, and then I will see you tomorrow to talk about In Bruges. Woo woo!